If I told you that three simple ideas, born decades apart, quietly built the entire AI revolution we're living in today, would you believe me? Because without them, ChatGPT, self-driving cars, or even your phone's face unlock wouldn't exist. In this video, we're breaking down the three core algorithms that built modern AI. Gradient descent, the brain's learning engine. Backpropagation, the teacher that fixes its mistakes. The transformer, the mind that made language models like GPT possible. By the end of this video, you'll not only understand how these work, but how together they turned math into intelligence. Let's start with gradient descent. Imagine you're standing on a mountain, blindfolded, and your goal is to reach the lowest point in the valley. You can't see anything, so you take tiny steps downhill, always going in the direction that feels steepest down. That's literally what gradient descent does. It's the algorithm that tells AI how to learn by finding the best values for millions or even billions of parameters. Here's how it works in simple terms. AI starts with random guesses. It makes a prediction. Maybe it's wrong. Then it calculates how wrong it was using something called a loss function. Gradient descent adjusts the parameters slightly to reduce that loss. Do this millions of times and the AI eventually gets really good at what it's doing, whether that's recognizing cats or writing essays. This is how machine learning models train. They don't memorize, they optimize. Fun fact, gradient descent was first formalized in the 1840s. Yes, before electricity was even a thing in homes. Now, let's talk about the real star of deep learning, backpropagation. Gradient descent tells the model how much to adjust, but backpropagation tells it where. It's like a student taking a test and having the teacher point out, you messed up this part of the equation, here's why. Here's what happens behind the scenes. The model makes a prediction. It checks how far off it was. That's the error. Then backpropagation sends that error backward through every layer of the neural network. Each neuron learns exactly how much it contributed to the mistake. That error signal is what updates the weights using gradient descent. This idea completely revived AI research in the 1980s when Jeffrey Hinton and others proved it could train deep neural networks. Without backpropagation, neural networks would still be stuck doing toy problems. With it, they started learning everything from speech to vision to strategy. And finally, the giant leap, the transformer. If gradient descent is the learner and backpropagation is the teacher, the transformer is the brain structure that made modern AI possible. Introduced by Google in 2017 in the paper, Attention is all you need. The transformer flipped how AI processes information. Before it, models like R, N, N, S, and L, S, T, M, S read text one word at a time, like reading through a straw. Transformers read everything at once, then figure out what's important using a mechanism called attention. Attention means, instead of treating every word equally, the model focuses on relationships, like when you read the sentence, the cat sat on the mat because it was tired. You instantly know it refers to the cat transformers learn that too, automatically. This parallel processing made them thousands of times faster to train and scale. And when combined with massive data and GPUs, we got GPT, Claude, Gemini, and every model you've heard of today. But here's the crazy part. These algorithms weren't invented to build intelligence. They were mathematical hacks. Gradient descent from calculus, backpropagation from control theory, transformers from language translation, and yet, when combined, they created systems that can code, paint, and reason. So the question is, are we discovering intelligence or accidentally recreating it? Think about it. Gradient descent is nature's version of evolution. It keeps tweaking until something works. Backpropagation is trial and error, just on steroids. And transformers? They're like human attention, the ability to focus on what matters. We didn't design intelligence. We reverse engineered it. We built something that learns, reflects, and generalizes the same way our brains do. And that's why AI progress feels exponential. Because once these three ideas clicked, everything else was just scaling them up. So when you hear that GPT-5 is coming, or that AI models are becoming agentic, remember this. It all traces back to three core ideas one from 1847, one from 1986, and one from 2017. Three mathematical tricks, 
now rewriting human history. That's not science fiction. That's the story of how algorithms turned into intelligence. So to recap, gradient descent taught machines how to learn. Backpropagation taught them how to correct mistakes. Transformers taught them how to understand context. Together, they're the foundation of everything from ChatGPT to AlphaFold to your phone's autocorrect. Free simple algorithms, infinite possibilities. Subscribe for more such videos and click on bell icon to get updated.